Hi everyone, my name is Roxy and how many times have you thought of doing a Harry Potter marathon? Because maybe you want to rewatch all the movies or you have that friend that has never watched them. I know it's shocking but these people exist. Or it's you the person who has never watched them and you want to watch them all together. Well, I just completed successfully a Harry Potter marathon and I have to tell you it's not easy so i collected and tested some tips and tricks and i want to share them with you guys today and now let's start so first of all some useful information to watch all the harry potter movies you need 19 hours and if you want to watch also fantastic beasts and where to find them you need 21 hours and 13 minutes so my suggestion is to do the marathon in two days other things that you will need are a TV, all the movies obviously, drinks, stay hydrated, snacks and food that you can easily eat while you're watching so you don't have to do too many breaks, a comfy place to watch the movies and I suggest also blankets and many comfy pillows if you want some decorations and if you want invite your friends because it's gonna be more fun. And another super important thing is a schedule. So I made a schedule with all the movies and the bathroom breaks, the food breaks, the drinking breaks, the discussion breaks, etc. And I'm gonna leave you the file in the description box, but right now I'm gonna tell you what we did. And let's start. So as I said, I did this marathon with my friends in two days. And the first day we woke up super early. We made some pancakes with some fruits and we started watching at 8 a.m. Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, which ended at 10.32 a.m. At this point, we took an eight minute break i prepared some potato chips and then at 10 40 a.m we started harry potter and the chamber of secrets this movie ended at 1 21 p.m it was lunch time so we took a 20 minute break and we prepared some sandwiches some hot dogs in my case they were vegan hot dogs because sandwiches and hot dogs are really easy to eat while watching a movie so at 1 40 we were able to start Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban and this one ended at 4.02 p.m. At this point we prepared some more coffee, we took an 8 minute break and then at 4.10 we started Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. This one ended at 6.47 p.m. and at this point we took a longer break to make a discussion break and also to prepare some food for dinner and then at 8 p.m we started harry potter and the order of phoenix which ended at 10 19 p.m and then we all went to sleep then we started the second day almost the same way we started at 8 a.m watching harry potter and the half blood prince with some pancakes some coffee and some cereal and that movie ended at 10 33 a.m i prepared some popcorns we did a seven minute break and then at 10 40 a.m we started harry potter and the deathly hallows part one this one ended at 1 6 p.m it was lunch time but we just took a 10 minute break we made some sandwiches and we started almost right away harry potter and the deathly hollows part two this one ended at 3 25 and then we had a long break for discussion because we finished all the harry potter movies but we also watched fantastic beasts and where to find them we started at 4 pm and we finished at 6 13. at this point we officially concluded the marathon, we celebrated with some pictures and some butter beer. Let me know if you wanna know the recipe. And that's it, this was an amazing experience, even if it was a little bit tough, but it was super fun and I suggest you to try once in your life. Let me know in the comments if you want other Harry Potter themed videos, if you want a makeup tutorial or some drink recipes, food recipes, decoration tutorial, whatever you want. And let me know if you did too this marathon and tag me in your pictures and in your tweets at RoxyRoxyV, hashtag RoxyRoxyV. As always, I say hi to all the people who tweeted me and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment down below, share it with all of your friends and see you guys next time. Bye! Mwah.